here we are. We're in a gym. And we're in a gym because we're doing a sport relief sketch. And um, we're doing an ab fab sketch. based on the Ab Fab characters. So we've got Eddie and Patsy with us. Um, we've got Emma Bunton as well. And then up in the bar, much later on, we have Kate Moss and Stella McCartney. You can't get to us until eight. And down here in the gym, um, we've got Colin Jackson, Linford Christie and David Hay, which is very exciting. Uh, so basically, Adina's stuck down here having to do the sport relief gym stuff and Patsy's upstairs sex in the city very glamorous drinking with the fashionistas and that's what we've got to achieve today yeah. Jennifer and I have worked out all the funny business um, so basically we just put our heads down and be funny <laughs> It's quite hard to pretend to be unfit for me. It's harder for Emma. It's harder for Emma. It's the only opposite. I don't do anything. No. She's much fitter than me. Yeah, I'm so much fitter than Emma. <laughs> She's a podge, isn't she, Emma? Bit of a podge. Bit of a podge at the moment. We're waiting now to do the opening sequence of the sport relief sketch that, um, that I wrote very recently. Dina has a moment on the cross trainer, falls off comes back onto the machine. We received the script at 8 o'clock last night, so they got it at about 5 past 8. <laughs> this morning, it's a little bit close to the mark. How did you go it just as, as I walked in before? I, yeah. For Jennifer, it's something of a record, because sometimes you get it just literally just before you go on. <laughs> that's, that's a lie. You get it about 10 minutes before you go on. It's going to be changing all the time, and I think that's the way that Jennifer usually likes to work anyway. Right. So the script will evolve right the way through the day. <laughs> That's why we love Jennifer. She writes everything off the cuff. Oh. <laughs> now for, we're going to have Emma Bunton here and Jennifer as Eddie on here. And we're going to give Colin Jackson a nice entrance. So we're set up this way and he will step in. Hopefully the audience go, oh, it's the Colin Jackson. So that's what we're going to do now. I've always been involved in Sport Relief and I was always in some kind of project from way back when. So, of course, when I was asked to do this, this really special app fab for Sport Relief, how could I turn it down? So, the call came, I changed my diary, and I'm here today. Well, let's get the both of you going. Well, technically, I am their fitness expert. <laughs> Not very qualified, well, I must admit, but <laughs> it is so much fun. And just feeding them a little bit of the lines and seeing how they work, it's just working wonders. And I've got to try and stop myself from smiling all the way through because I am a big fan. <laughs> I didn't think it was biologically possible to be that unfit. <laughs> And cut there. Colin, Colin is actually a natural, but I think he probably spends more time in front of a television camera than the rest of us, so he's slightly showing us up. Colin Jackson's brilliant. He just came in, did his lines, and uh, yeah, so far so good. We've just done a scene in the gym with Adina, and um, I've appeared as a uh, um, little devil on the shoulder because we have this love-hate relationship so I'm giving her words of encouragement while she's on the treadmill. Excuse me darling. Get, see what I mean? See what I have to work with. Fat woman! <laughs> I always wanted one of those. <laughs> That's the perfect thing. That's for later. And she'll be there punching with I am most looking forward to punching Emma Bunton and for her to punch me back. That's what I'm most looking forward to. Jennifer goes whack like that. 
I'm doing a, I had a quick look at the script. I'm not doing actually that much. I've got to be a, I'm be a boxing trainer. And um, a little bit of an altercation between a few of the girls. So, should be ah. fun. Today we are going to film something slightly short of Dr. Zhivago in about 25 minutes. Jennifer has thought this one through and it has got a shape and a lovely idea to it. It's great. Always, when you're being made up properly by professionals, leave some makeup on underneath, add it, and then during the day, add more. And then just before midnight, add more. Well, Emma's got the new pink gloves that David bought. And I said stupidly, I said stupidly, I would have these gloves, which and they stink. They stink. They stink of sweat. Go right in. No, go right in. Go right in. Yeah. <laughs> See what I do for her? This was just like jokey exercise, but it's like real exercise at the same time. It's, it's like really... You think of it as just joking, just acting. No, it's exercise. It's doing my head in. It's actually doing my back in. It's fun, it's good. To separate the two girls, going crazy there. Real power floating about there. Patsy, I'm just holding two drinks. Here you are, Eds. You see, I can say that. Do you hear this extraordinary sound? It's a chorus. I like to have music with me wherever I am, where you know, learning or looking at lines. So I've got a small chorus of people who just do voiceless, wordless howling in the background. I think that's what it is, is it? Uh, you just tell me it's, it's the wind blowing. Uh, Linford Christie's in the next scene. Sorry. And um, uh, I've got to pretend not to be that tired now because I haven't done the boxing yet. Um, but yes, yeah, Linford's here. And I am quite tired. <laughs> now I'm going to get up close and personal with Jennifer. So come and join us, Linford. There while Jennifer crawled up my legs, you know, it's a first. <laughs> So many people, you know, children around the world and everything else. So, you know, it's, it's I think, the least us, us sports people can do to try and give something back. You know, we, we go out there, we perform, and we get support. So, if someone can give us support, we can also give, you know, others less fortunate than ourselves some support. That's it, lovely. So we finished in the gym now 
and that went terribly well. All the men were absolutely brilliant. Who would have thought that David Hay was a natural actor? But he is. And now we are back in the bar where Patsy is waiting for them and we do the end. And now we're by the presence of um, David Gandhi, Kate Moss and Stella McCartney. So we've gone from sport luminaries to fashion luminaries. Um, I'm feeling a lot better since I got out of that gym then. Frozen Betty Jackson's clothes. That's a lot of so it's fun. Everyone was really, really good, and so therefore, of course, we can keep up to speed. But we're losing people, and people are coming, and it's London Fashion Week, and we are 45 minutes from London Fashion Week, and we don't know if they're going to get here on time, but I suspect they will. But that's uh, that's nothing we can do about that. Eddie, Eddie, who are the others? David. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we just completed Emma Bunton. We just struck her. Thank you so much. I've had the best day, lots of laughs. Obviously, being with Jenna and Jennifer is always very special. And um, I just loved being involved. Thank you for having me. And it's all about sports relief, so. Mwah. This is my look with baby Bunton, the fit me. Um, because, and it means that she can't then, you know, meet Bella and Kate and Bodie, the gorgeous David Gandhi. <laughs> <laughs> it's like and this, this little hunchback next to this ugly little hunchback attached to this gorgeous man. <laughs> Any time. Um, I'm not doing very much, thank goodness. I've only got a couple of lines and um, trying not to laugh at uh, Patsy and Eddie, I think, because that, 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 I'm a terrible, terrible giggler. So uh, we'll see how it goes. Here we go. And action. Brilliant. Thank you. 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 Thank She's turning up in any minute now, and then we're, we're ready to roll. Um, a clothes show, <laughs> David. No, I had. Um, <laughs> I've got a fashion show tomorrow, so I was um, busy beavering away. At that. This this kind of thing comes first. I hate to say, it's a far better cause than pretty clothes. I think if we can, you know, convince them that we pulled it off, yeah, then you know. we can do anything. <laughs> All as good as they think they are. <laughs> Just wind up. Just watch Jennifer the whole time and I'll just go now and then you start the dialogue. Lovely. Right, let's see if we... Quiet, please.
I've known for a while. Yeah. Obviously, CNA, me and Paxico. I'm talking about 20 years, actually, darling. Yeah, you know, a little sweet, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. Tall rules, you know. That one or that one? Looking at the gurney, everyone, and action! Well, we did it. It was a moment when we didn't think we were going to. We started 40 minutes late. Stella McCartney was stuck in the Friday night traffic, but we've done it. Night night. Oh, well, it's um, 10 o'clock at night now, so we've been for 12 hours and it's all gone really well. And we finished on time, yay, this is Miley Fletcher's brilliant director. And I think it's, I think, I mean, I'm hopeful, hopefully, when it's all cut together, it will be funny. I'm hoping. It's hard to kind of know because it's been quite a rush today and quite doing everything quite fast. Um, but it will all be in the editing, let's say that. <laughs> Thank you, bye bye.